Hi guys, Ryu here with Nanitude for Blender and let's talk about booleans. I'm going to show you how to create advanced booleans, which are much more interesting than simple booleans. So let's grab a cylinder and give it a 50 verts. Uh, give it some bevel and let's also change this display to something more interesting because it's a bit boring. There we go. Now, so normally if you just cut something right with a boolean, it's just going to be, you know, a simple cut, right? But we can make it a little bit more, a bit more fun. So let's grab um, this magnet tool from Box Cutter and let's grab um, change view to object, fine. And let's draw a circle in the middle. So you hold control and draw a circle and let's increase number of words to 50. So it's more or less the same, right? Actually, it's exactly the same because you the cylinder is 50. So let's uh, shift click it and let's go to face mode and we can do something like this Q, control and mark and we can bevel it outside. Now let's grab this and let's apply the modifiers. Let's go to edge mode and in, in local mode let's uh, drop a loop in here. Let's bevel this and now let's go to Q and Alt click on macro to do something like this. And now we're gonna go to solid mode. We're gonna have this interesting cut in here. But things are gonna get better. So now what we're gonna do is cut the cutter. So let's go to box and let's do something like this. And maybe a radius to the other side and bevel it just a little bit. And let's Oh, we're not in the view mode, so let's switch to view mode. Let's do it again. So, cut it, bevel it, and radius with shift, more or less on the other side, and let's just cut it. Perfect. So now that's our, that's our, uh, it's actually a single boolean, right, at the moment. Bevel is a bit too big, so let's make it a bit smaller. Nice. Now we can keep working on this shape. So let's recover this uh, cutter, go to top view and let's go to circle and let's cut it from the top with a uh, array on Y axis. And just drop two cuts and then let's reposition them. All right, so let's grab these two and reposition them slightly because they're not in the middle. So somewhere here. Now we can mirror them on cursor, hold shift and mirror them on both sides. Perfect. Now we have something like this. So let's hide this and this one as well, actually. And this one, see what we got. Okay. Now we can keep going. So let's grab the main shape and let's go to local. Let's grab these faces. Let's check or deselect them. Uh, do it again. Check or deselect them. Let's inset them a little bit. Then go to vert mode. Go to circle. Let's make it smaller. Okay. Let's go to face mode and let's inset them inside. So Q and here yeah, macro. And boom. Okay, let's see what we got. Nice, single boolean. Let's apply uh, weighted normals so we have a bit, a bit of a better shading. So let's put some supporting beams in this, uh, shall we? So let's grab this cutter again. Let's grab the cutter, let's go to side view and let's cut some beams across like this here. So let's grab... Uh, box and slice it in the middle here yep let's grab this cutter and let's flip it on 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 the cursor on the y-axis and let's cut it with some end guns so I think we're in a view mode. We're in a view mode. Perfect. So let's let's slice it in here. 
Holy control. Blender gonna start slowing down. Un unfortunately, it's unavoidable. That's just Blender limitations. Cool. Now let's grab a box and let's slice some cool shapes in here. Whoops, we on the mirror side. We need to cut on this side. Can you set some grill? So V for array. Let's make it a bit smaller. Perfect. No, it's this one. Actually, Alt H is going to be faster. And let's just simply copy it across. And there we go. And that, guys, is a single cutter. Right? So you can create some really complex shapes with single boolean if you just, you know, work with it. So now this shape is still, um, you know, non-destructive, right? There is, it's just a cylinder. We'll give it a bash, guys. Playing with booleans is a lot of fun. And you can create some really cool shapes. Hope you enjoyed the vid. Give us a like and subscribe if you did, and I'll talk to you in the next one.